What up guys, welcome back to my channel. This is The Coder here and in today's video, I'll be showing you how you can uh, add basically, you know, speech, text to speech to your website in just one line of code. Literally one line of code. Okay, now as you can see over here, uh, yeah, this is like I was filming before, so I'm just gonna erase that. As you can see over here, this is the this is what I made. And once I click on this button, it will speak what I wrote here. The responsive voice API is awesome. Yeah, we all know it. And um, yeah, so you can like write anything over here. Like my name is Jagro, let's say. Okay, let's see how it pronounces my name. My name is Jagro. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So anyway, this is the responsive voice API and all you need to add in your code is this line, this teeny tiny line. And that's how you can get it speak. But of course, it's not so easy. There's a bunch of stuff that I have not showed in the thumbnail itself. That is, you need to sign up for this responsive voice, right? You need to have your own API key. You cannot just use my API key. Or maybe you can you know I don't really care if you want you can use my API key but if you want to create an API key by yourself and know more about responsive voice API then keep watching this video by the way all these codes the links would be down in the description below so yeah you can check it out so yeah like once you come to uh, responsive voices website this is not what it shows um, but like yeah I wrote that and um, you know I can make it say anything there is a poop and in so a variety voice. of like voices as you can see over here there are a bunch of different accents yeah accents and um genders also you know it's only male and female of course so don't expect too much and um as you can see i can change the accent over here also like over here there is a poop it's u.s Select english male Select i can make it u.s english female there is a poop and Select i can voice. also make it let's try india so select a voice yeah dj4 ah yeah exactly <laughs> so um now like once you land on this website the first thing that you want to do is um sign into it so you can just click here on sign in and go to app dashboard and that's gonna lead you to the sign in page and what i want you to do is click on this you don't have an account sign up but link yeah so once you do that it will ask you for an email address and um, what I'm using here is temp mail and for those who don't know what temp mail is it's basically a really cool website from where you can get temporary email addresses so yeah that's pretty cool and I can just paste it in here and yeah I don't I didn't even have to use my own email address and yeah I won't be spammed or anything you know I yeah I just I just need the freaking API key and the next thing that you want to do by the way is uh, enter a full name so I'd rather just use Alex Simt, yeah, and then just enter a eight word password. Like it can be anything, you know, it doesn't really matter. You don't need to log back in once you're done. Now you can get your code, click on get your code. And once you do that, this is what you are going to, uh, this is what you're going to see. Okay. So uh, yeah, it says your site is not verified yet. Yeah, whatever. Um, you can just copy this code over here and then just add it to your own website code so i'm just gonna add it over here and as you can see i just added it over here and literally respond i'm like i'm done connecting to responsive voice right now already okay and all i need to do now is just type in here responsive voice dot speak okay like unlike like the amount of code we wrote in order to make our computer speech in this speech synthesis api we do not have to do any of that like any of that when we are using responsive voice it's literally just one line of code and you can just type in anything over here basically it takes in the text over here so i can just type in this is the text or yeah this, this is, is the way this is the way exactly that's what the mandalorian said <laughs> okay anyway so you can see you can make anything like execute over here this is the way this is the way and um, of course for those who are wondering how the hell am I supposed to change the accent so in order to change the accent what you can do is just click cross over here and um, yeah like once you're logged in this is the this is what you're gonna see and um, you are always going to have this code over here so you can copy whenever you want to and add it to like million different websites you want to and um, yeah the key is available right there 
now sorry if it's too zoomed out for you guys so yeah the key is available right there and um, well what you want to do in order to change the voice and everything you need to go here uh, in API documentation and click on this API and once you click on that it will take you to this link responsive voice API and then yeah that's the link where you'll find the documentation at and once you get the documentation you can see like the bunch of stuff that you can do with this API so that's actually pretty like freaking cool right now what you can do is you can see you can pass a bunch of arguments uh, when you're using this responsive voice.speak function um, and I want you to like if you want to like change the accent and the gender okay. on the voice then you can yeah. just simply copy this and I'm just gonna mute this side yeah because it keeps speaking so anyway, I can just copy this part and once I'm done copying it, I can just paste it here. And now this is the way. Yeah, now it's the main voice. This is the way. See that? Notice that? And I can literally change this to anything like indie mail. This is the way. See, this is the way. This is the way. Exactly, that's how you speak. This is the way. Yeah. <laughs> so um um yeah, so that's working of course and um there's a bunch of other arguments that you can pass in also. You can pass in like the volume, the rate, the pitch. Now if you want to know what these are, the pitch is basically how high your voice would be. So if I'm using this over here, I can just paste it here. This is the way. <laughs> <laughs> this is the way. Okay, that was pretty hilarious. Um, and you can also pass in um, this rate over here. So I'm just gonna copy this rate from here and paste it in my code. Paste. This is the way. See how fast it said? If you did not notice, here we go again. This is the way. This is the way. Okay, and, um, and um, yeah, we also have this volume thingy. So it's basically the volume of the voice, you get it. Yeah. And I think it's like from 0 to 1. So if you put 0 0.5 here, let's see what happens. This is the way. The voice like volume should go down. This is the way. I mean, you are not going to notice it because like you're listening to the virtual microphone. But anyway, um, yeah, there's a bunch of other stuff also like on start and on end. You know, you can like run functions using these. Like basically once the voice starts speaking, it will fire this on start part, uh, which will let you fire like functions and all other stuff. So yeah, it's a pretty cool thing. You can see how many different kinds of functions that you have. You can check them all out at this link over here. The link's gonna be down in the description below. Okay, and um, of course I'm just going to paste the code because it's literally just one line of code. Okay, yeah. Uh, yeah so you can see like you know you needed to like write i don't know how many lines of code i wrote here but like it was a like of course it was bigger than one line you know in one line you can make your computer speak over here and over here we are using one two three four four lines <laughs> who's gonna and also that four line is not supported on every browser so yeah yeah <laughs> we don't want to use that stupid api we can just use this amazing responsive voice api yeah anyway uh, that's it you know that's it for this video um it's basically about how you can like see how small the video was as well it's that's how easy it is to use responsive voice and i just wanted to make this video because a lot of people were like dude how am i going to make my computer speak it's not speaking you know and I was like, okay, okay, I'm gonna help you out. I'm gonna create a video. And then I started procrastinating and I did not make a video for quite a long while. Now I'm back. So yeah, I'll be creating videos on a weekly basis. So yeah, I hope I'll post, yeah. Anyway, so uh, that's it. And yeah, one more thing guys, by the way, I recently actually started a new Discord server. So you can see over here, it's this Discord server and you guys can also join. There's not a lot of members on it because I'm not famous and anything. So yeah, if you guys want to, then please, please, please do join. The link is down in the description below. Please do check it out. Okay, I'll be like, I'll be really happy or else I'll cry. I'll really cry a lot. And um, yeah, this was the Responsive Voice API. I hope you liked the video. If you like the video, like uh, the video. And if you did not, then subscribe. And um, yeah. <laughs>
Of course, comment also in case this is not working for you. Okay, I am always there to help you out. And, um, you know, to get better response from me, you can join my Discord server. That's where I respond the most because I spend a lot of time there. <sighs> okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna go now. My voice is cracking down. I just realized I really missed out on something very important. This responsive voice API can also speak other languages. I completely forgot. I'm really sorry, guys. Um, as you can see, I can just open Google Translator over here. Google Translate. Yeah. And I can literally make it speak Hindi over here. So I can say, how are you, idiot? Okay. And let's see over here. Let's type in Hindi. And there we go. We got Hindi. Tum kaise? Bebakupo. <laughs> okay, so uh, let's make it print. So, paste. Now listen to it properly. By the way, I'm uh, like, it, the default um, accent and everything is set to the language basically. And everything is set to um, American female. So, yeah, that's not what we really want. Or else it will sound like this. Tuma Kaiser Bebaku for ho. Yeah, that's not Hindi. Okay, in order to make it speak real Hindi, we are just going to type in Hindi in... Come on, what the heck? Hindi mail. Yeah, you can just type in Hindi mail and now listen to it. See, it's real Hindi. And you can even get female voice over here like... Female... Paste. See, it literally is Hindi. Okay, the real Hindi. So yeah, you can make it speak um, other languages as well. Okay, like Italian, Singaporean, or you can make it speak whatever you want to in other languages also. But don't make it speak English in um, Indian accent or else. How are you? Yeah, I, I mean, it kind it sounds pretty cool, but like yeah you get it you know you cannot make an american person speak hindi but you can make an indian person speak english so yeah it's me you know one of them so yeah i feel like i'm hypocrite now thanks for watching again and now i'm gonna go bye